Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith. Let's have a look at Drag and Drop Heaven with a free new program called Portal. All right, the wonderful folks at Knights of the Editing Table have given us yet another free program, and you can check that out on their website, Knights of the Editing Table. Um, right there, it's called Portal, and you can also get Arrow 2, and then Encompass, and a game, and then there's a few other amazing uh, tools that I've shown in the past, like Excalibur and Watchtower are just incredible. But uh, the new program is compatible with Premiere Pro, After Effects, Audition, Animate, Media Encoder, Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign, InCopy, and Dreamweaver. So what is it? It is a panel that is in each one of those applications that has a clickable button to go to any directory on your computer. Let's open it up in Premiere Pro and add some of these. Okay, in the window menu, after you install it, it's in the extensions. There it is, I'll open that up. And we get, we get a prompt here to drag and drop portals. So you can right click and add portals and pick, but for all those drag and drop fans, you can just drag and drop. So in my footage folders, I'll go to my art grid, which is now art list max. And let's go to my culinary, drag that in. Let's drag uh, business in. And how about DJ? So there they are. When you click on them now, they're going to open that particular folder and you can drag and drop from there. So we could take this and uh, position this wherever we want. So I'll click on the name and I'll drag it over here. I'm gonna hold the control key or the command key to float this again. We can, we can't make this, we can make this a little bit smaller here. And uh, you can see it changes horizontal or vertical depending on how much room you happen to have. So if I wanted this to be part of the interface, um, I could drag it over here, drop it in there, open up that and from here, drag my images into my program. Go back, grab some business. So again, it's for those drag and drop fans that love that kind of environment. I know uh, a lot of people that drag and drop everywhere is what they love. So again, this points to any directory anywhere. So, and let's go to Photoshop. And in Photoshop, it's in the window extensions legacy. I've already added these and colored these. So you can right click and color these any color you want. Uh, if that helps you organize it, click on my backgrounds and there it is. So now I can drag that into Photoshop. It opens up. Now, of course, with Photoshop, when you open up another uh, image and drag it in, it's going to actually place that in there as a smart object. So dragging and dropping with nothing open then imports that in. But you can see this one is different. Backgrounds, people, photos, and actions. And back in Premiere Pro, Culinary Business and DJ, they are independent of each other. There's one other feature that's relative path. The relative path is for people who use a specific organization of a, of a template of uh, folders for things like, like a template where they have video, audio, images, and they have that in every project, then this will point to the video folder that is part of that project. Now let's just open up another project here. And you can see these are global. So culinary business and DJ are not part, it's not a project setting, it's a global setting. 
So that's an easy way to have access to your folders uh, wherever they are on your computer with portals by adding them in the free application called Portal. Um, if you want updates so that the, the project panel in Premiere Pro is a mirror image of what you have on your desktop, that's not something Premiere Pro does. That's what Watchtower is for. And I'll have a link to that and a link to my tutorial on that. Two different things, but they're kind of similar operations if you're working with images and media and trying to get stuff into uh, Premiere Pro. But Portal is free and it works in all those Adobe applications. Hey, if you're new to Video Revealed and you like me showing you free stuff like this, take a moment and subscribe. You want to support us some more, you can do that on videorevealed.com slash shop. Donate once monthly, any amount. We really do appreciate all of our wonderful donors. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to have a look at the stuff that the Knights of the Editing Table are doing and uh, make sure you're aware of some cool stuff that you can use today. Hey.